Welcome back to our channel. If you are a current subscriber, thank you so much for subscribing. We're going to be doing a thousand subscriber giveaway to show our appreciation for all of those of you who have subscribed to our channel. So you want to be part of that, hit that subscribe button. And also, if you like our video, please hit that like button too, because that will help our channel out immensely and will help us to provide more videos for you. Today our topic is sprouting corn for your chickens. And really it's any grain, um, oat, wheat, barley, any grain, you would be able to sprout for your chickens to have a really nutritious meal. There are numerous benefits to sprouting grains for your chickens. Not the least of which is you're taking something small and you're increasing the volume so they actually have more to eat. Let's talk about also the nutritional benefits of sprouting grains. One of the greatest benefits of sprouting grains for your chickens is year-round access to fresh greens no matter what the season or what the weather is like, because this is something that you can do um, in a sunny window all year round. Sprouting grains makes the grain more easily digestible for the chickens. In fact, um, I read that 40 per to 50% more digestible for the chickens, which means they're going to get more of the vitamins, the minerals, the proteins um, available to them because they can digest it more easily. In addition, the sprouts are loaded with um, beta carotene and chlorophyll, which results normally in darker egg yolks and more nutritional value for your eggs. So there are a lot of great benefits to sprouting grain and it's easy. Let's take a look at just how easy this process is. One of the things you want to do is make sure you use a high quality grain. I have a friend at work named Marla whose husband is an organic farmer and she hooked us up with some organic corn to try this little experiment. So let's get into this. The first probably three days I soaked it in water. I changed the water twice a day to make sure that it was clean. So here you can see, it looks like nothing is happening and it's actually very disappointing in the first couple of days. It doesn't start sprouting right away. But if you take a look on day five, I could see some pretty good evidence of sprouts. So what I did was I took two trays um, that I used to sprout seeds for the garden. The top tray has slits in it so that water can drain off. You don't want them to sit in water or partial water when you're actually growing the sprouts because you don't want them to ferment. And what I really did was I just put the tray down in the tray of water, let it soak for a little bit, and then I pulled it up and uh, turned it a little bit so that it would stay up and drain. And I did change that water um, fairly often because you don't want it to get nasty and it will start to smell if it's getting nasty so you want to make sure you're changing that water. You also want to make sure it's in a sunny location. You want the sun to get to it, you want it to grow. So put it in a probably a south facing window for most of you that are watching this video. After about seven days I had some pretty good sprouts going. Now when should you feed these to your chickens? Well, I could have fed it to the chickens on day seven. They do have some sprouts. Um, but what I read was that they have the best bang for your buck as far as volume that you're feeding them and nutritional value. The best bang for your buck is about three inches high. So I wanted to keep growing these until they were about three inches high. Here you see days 10 and 11. Got some really good sprouting action going there. On day 12, it looks like they're ready. So um, on day 12 is when I probably should have fed it to them, but 
I work full time and I didn't have time to do the actual video of them eating it. So I waited until about day 13 or 14 to feed it to them. Here you see it in some containers. Look at all that nice, nutritious roots and sprouts and everything that they're gonna be getting out of this grain. So now let's take a look at a little video of our chickens eating sprouted grains for the first time. All right, there's Carl, 10 weeks old. He's looking really big. Let's see how they like it. Looking at it. So that's it for sprouting grains for your chickens. Uh, I hope you'll try it. And if you liked our video and you want to see more, please hit that like button and please don't miss that thousand subscriber giveaway. Hit the subscribe button also so you can see everything that we're doing on our homestead to build our homestead for retirement. As always, I hope you are having a fantastic day and we'll see you next time.